You can come to me for honesty. That's 100% a lie. Oh, third out of the third, I don't have any money to invest. He's saying, if you just invest in PC gaming, you'd be getting so much more out of it. I don't have money to do 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 it. I don't have money to pay my fucking taxes. You think I'm going to buy a fucking gaming PC? You're out of your mind. All right? Jesus. So basically, I don't have money. Like, a lot of people think, oh, Phil, he's a streamer. He lives the life, right? I don't have any money. All the money I have goes straight to, the, to all these situations, all right? Me getting a pet right now probably would not make sense since that's money that should be going towards more important things. And in particular, Kat and I have talked about getting a pet like a cat. And I would like to have a cat. I've never had a cat in my life. Cats can be really cool passive pets. You don't really need to spend too much attention on them once they're you know adjusted to a home. Uh, they're pretty independent. They're not a lot of work. Um... And Kat, in particular, has had cats during her lifetime, and she likes them. And I said, I think that would be a cool pet for us to get. You know, I could bring the cat on stream every once in a while to hang out. You know. But, uh, the bottom line is the following. We're not going to do that until we get everything resolved. Like, I, we would love right now to say, let's get a pet. But, what happens if by the end of this year, and again, this is a worst case scenario, so knock on wood, it doesn't happen. Uh... Streams or well, streams on YouTube don't end up being as profitable as I'd hoped. I don't make enough money to pay my taxes, and now I'm in a situation where I'm screwed. Because if you don't pay your taxes, you're you're completely boned in the United States. They'll put liens on your property. They'll screw you over completely. Okay. Um. <clears throat> so that being said, there's a, a a chance by the end of this year, I may not be able to live here anymore. I hate that to say that. <clears throat> After ten years of working my ass off, you know. And in particular, right now, let's be honest, guys. Things are very positive. I don't want to be this have this be a downer to you guys. This is why I haven't been talking about it at all recently. But things have been great. Like I said, May was the best month so far this, this year. Things are great. People are coming out to the streams and contributing in a big way. You guys are helping me out tremendously. And don't think that your contributions aren't helping or anything like that or that I'm unappreciative. I am. That's why I'm not talking about this kind of stuff frequently anymore. I don't want to have you guys brought down by this stuff. It's my business, not really, not yours, to, to be worrying about this, okay? Right? That being said, um, I don't want to get a pet, and then next thing you know, the end of the year, that's it. I got to put my house on the market because I can't pay the taxes on it. And, you know, you know I got to sell the house to pay taxes with the profit from the sale. And now we're moving from place to place, and a pet is now being in a house it just got used to. Now it has to be moved. It's just not worth it. You know, I told Kat, I said, listen, if we, if we get to a situation here where now by the end of the year it looks like we're good... And the taxes are great, and we don't have to. We, everything's paid, no problems. Sure, next year let's get a pet, let's do a few things, right? But right now everything's so uncertain because I don't know what the hell's going to happen financially between now and the end of the year. All right, so it sucks. It really does suck. Like I wish I had freedom over my life right now. I do not. I'm basically a slave to what happens financially between now and the end of the year, and that's why I'm not looking to get pets. I'm not looking to do any major investments. You know. Why doesn't Phil just splurge and buy a PS4 Pro to get rid of his audio issues? Because I can't. That Any money I get has to go towards these taxes so I can stay in this house, you know? <clears throat> so that's the real talk, guys, all right? What the hell is this in my cart? Oh, my God, it's still in my cart. <laughs> I had ordered it, but I apparently I had put it in my cart again because someone... Uh, I, was, I was basically the person who... Uh, who donated the money to, to buy the TV. I wanted to send them the stats. So I added it back into my cart. I got to delete it. I don't want to accidentally order it again. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's, it's the, it's the TCL four series, 49 inch. Someone who actually is not a new addition to the family. Someone who I'm going to, uh, to introduce you to today, who has been a part of our lives for quite some time, in fact. All right? And it's funny because we've, with all the stuff that we've had to do, we've had to keep a lot of stuff private. Come on up here. Here he is. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce you to our pet. Oh, he's playing with this. Oh, here we go. Here's our pet. 
<laughs> yeah, here we go. Perfect. <laughs> this is Jasper, ladies and gentlemen. Jasper the cat. So here's the deal. I had to do everything I behind the, the couch. I had to do everything I possibly could to kind of, you know, hide this from, from everything because for personal reasons, you know, um, basically he's been a part of our lives for a long time. All right. In fact, before the wedding and everything this year, you know, a lot of people surmised they were like, Phil, why is it that you needed to have a, a friend come by the house and kind of house it for you while you were in Connecticut to get married? There's your answer. Okay. Um, we didn't want to leave him alone and we didn't have, we couldn't afford to pay to like put him up or anything like that. So we had a, a friend come by and kind of hang out with, uh, with Jasper uh, for an hour or two a day and feed him and everything while we were in Connecticut. He's not new. He's been with us for actually quite some time. Just now we're finally revealing it. Yes, I did make several hundred dollars in tips recently. I love this guy. Didn't you just make hundreds of dollars recently? Yes, and that went to bills. As I said, this is the worst financial position I've ever been in my entire life. I need as much support as possible right now in the short term to get through this next week or else I'm screwed, okay?